Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today, together, we are going to make this photo manipulation. Keep watching. Okay, first of all, we will bring all the items inside our document and put each and every one inside its own group. I will remove this background here with the help of my pen tool and remove this white sky and put another sky and put all the items inside each and every group because later we will add our adjustment layers inside each group. some curves adjustment layers inside for each and every character to reduce the lightning then inside the group of the house I will add a lookup table from day to night to change the whole scene from day to night and then I will add some green solid colors and change its blending mode to color to add some green tone to all the items and I will play with the opacity just a little bit Now it's time to add the light. Basically what I'm doing is adding a green solid color adjustment layer and changing its blending mode to mainly color dodge and with the help of the blend F slider I will make it blend better with the items and then we'll paint the lightning on the edges with a very low flow and my hard ground brush and then remove from this and then with a black brush, faded black brush, I will remove the edges, just adding and removing. For the lantern, I will add another color layer, but this time it will be red. Also, I will lose the blend F to blend the color more. And then I will add another layer on top of it with a very low flow. Same process with a very low flow. I will try to bend the highlights, the red highlights this time on the character and the surrounding area. and also on the face of the character itself because the light will be reflected on its face its face, its finger, this stick he is holding, everything to add some depth to the image I will go inside the sky layer and add some Gaussian blur And also in the house layer I will add some blur. Mm -hmm. 
then I will go to my brush I choose any grass brush any grass brush you have and I will also add this brush in the description for you if you want to use it just painting some grass to add some depth to the image and also will add some blur to the grass And then I will get my rounded brush and paint some red lights on the grass and change the opacity to blend it even more with the scene. And maybe painting some dark colors on the edges. And then I will take any smoke brush and add some layers of smoke between the elements. Then I will paint some red on the sky and with the help of the blend F I will blend it even more with the scene and maybe changing the blending mode of this layer to colors. For finalizing, I will make a screenshot of each and everything on top of everything, Control shift alt e and then I will change this to a smart object in case I want to change anything later. Then inside the camera raw filter, I will tweak the sliders, adding some greens and playing with all those sliders until I guess it fits best. And of course in the color grading I will add some greens to the shadows and some reds to the highlights. And I will add some vignetting to make the focus in, inside to make the focus inside my design. before and after before and after and that's it that was my quick tutorial about today see you next time